I get it. As an actor, we have lots of expenses. And the last thing we want to do is subscribe to yet another casting website. But IMDb Pro is worth investing in. And I'm going to show you why. So let's get after it. Kristen Henry King, and you are watching Kristen Keeps It Real. And in today's episode, I'm going to talk about the basics of IMDb Pro and why you need it. And also stick around to the end where I announce the winner of the IMDb Pro giveaway. First, what does IMDb stand for anyway? Internet Movie Database. You can look up any actor, producer, casting director for any movie in any time, at any time. But if you're a professional, you're going to want IMDb Pro. IMDb Pro is where casting directors and any other industry personnel can look you up to see what you've done, who is your representation, and if you're the right fit for the show that they're casting. Guys, this is your number one marketing tool. And I don't say that lightly. When you get a subscription, not only can you put up a picture of your choosing, but you are able to control your own IMDb. For example, if you do a short film that gets put on IMDb, and if someone looks up the cast of that project and everyone has a picture and a profile but you, and you are just a blank space, this gives off the impression that you either are new, have left acting, don't care, or don't want to spend the money to invest in your own career. Either way you look at it, you don't exist as a professional. Another awesome feature is that you can literally search anything and get all the contact information you need to create a connection. Let's say you want a new talent agent and you live in Chicago. All you have to do is go to companies, check off your city, narrow it down to agents, and there you have a list of all the agents from top to bottom. Here you can also see their company meter. This little number identifies the clout of the company. The closer to one they are, the more actors they have that are working and are trending. See, a company meter goes up when one or several of their actors are on hit shows in which everyone is looking these actors up, thereby pulling up their star meter, the actor star meter. Something else that is assigned to you when you get a subscription and the ability to know where everyone else stands. So, actors who have higher star meters are most likely to be with an agent who has a high company meter, which means they have high caliber booking talent. And you want to be in that pool of agents who are able to get their actors in big rooms. So again, a high company meter means they are closest to the number one. However, don't get discouraged if your agent's company meter is not that high because you still have the factor of your actual agent's tenacity and own drive to pitch you to getting into one of these rooms. Just like an actor's star meter fluctuates, so does an agent's. Now let's say there is a casting director you love because you realize that every show you like, she casts and you want to one day be on her radar. All you have to do is type in her name, hit the blue track button, and you will now receive alerts anytime there is any news or what they're working on next. This also works for producers, directors, actors, and more. So let me show you how I use this tool practically. If there is an audition I get, and it states the casting director or any of the other cast members or production or producers, etc., I look them all up, especially if I end up booking the job. So I know what they look like and can familiarize myself with their work before working on set. When I auditioned for Community, I realized I would be hooked up with one of the leads whose type was smart, kind of nerdy, so instead of walking into the audition all glammed up and sexy-like, I wore glasses and had a matching disposition to his. So it looked like we would click as a couple and we would just go. Now, if this character was strapping and had a different demeanor on the show, I would have changed my character choice completely. So in essence, IMDb Pro gave me the edge and the leg up I needed to book the job. 
I also use this technique when I get an audition for a show that hasn't aired yet. If I can't watch an episode, I try and look for a show that is on air that the writer of this show I'm auditioning for also wrote. If there's an episode available, I watch that instead to get the vibe of his writing style as well as the director if need be, and I bring those elements into the new show I'm auditioning for. As an added bonus, there is contact information for every single person on there, which you can't get on regular old IMDb. But what if there's an actor you really like or know that's going out a lot and you want that for yourself? Well, did you know you can find out who their reps are as well? Let's take a look at my friend Gino. I can look him up, see who his representation is, look at their clients and their company meter, go down the line and see if they have any person that's my type already. And if I like what I see, boom, here is all their information right there. I send them a cover letter, throw my friend's name in, if he gives me permission, and now I have gotten myself that much closer to getting the career I envision. And lastly, IMDb Pro is also a place where you can get casting notices. Simply go to jobs, pick your zone, choose paid or unpaid, union or non, hit search, and here are all your notices you can submit on. And now for the winner of a one year, $150 subscription to IMDb Pro, brought to you by Survivor Publishing, the founder of SurvivorSong.net. And here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Envelope, please. I was hoping it'd be him. Okay. <clears throat> and the IMDb Pro account goes to Giovanni Montoya, actor, dancer, rapper, and filmmaker from Miami, Florida, and at the right age of 14. Well done on all your success so far. And now it's time to collect your prize. Make sure to email me at Kristen Keeps It Real, spelled R E E L, at gmail.com. Again, congratulations. I'm sure I'll see your name in the comments. Hope you guys got some value out of that. If so, leave it in the comments below. Would love to hear from you. Bye for now.